If you were able to determine the criteria by which candidates would participate in these televised debates, what criteria would you use? Well, I was uh, astonished when I saw the methodology that first Fox was going to use and CNN with its own little spin just struck me as they didn't have a pollster at the table when they were deciding to use national polls to do it. I'm, I care about a meaningful universe, that is, whose opinion matters in how we're going to select the president. So p having a national poll, we don't nominate presidents through national voting in any way. So I'll, right from the get-go, I'm going, well, that's kind of crazy. And then it, it, it sort of worked out that it, that it turned out to be a robust way of measuring popularity. If it were up to me, I would have given part of the equation to Iowa and who was polling well in Iowa, part of the equation to New Hampshire and who was polling well there. And then I might take a look and broaden it and look at the Super Tuesday states. Obviously, South Carolina and Nevada are in there as well. But, but th those are the states that are most likely going to be the ones deciding who the nominee is going to be. And I would have figured out a way for them to have more voice.